out a new sponsor to Health Blaze. All the information is in the description. Use the promo code above. Good filler one boxing at 18% off of all their natural products from deodorant, pomade, toothpaste, and much, much more. And they have additional discounts on their website as well. That's the healthblaze.com. Start December 20th. That promo code is good for 18% off. We go. All right, we back. Goodfella Sports TV. Um, it's your boy CJ Goodfella. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon button. We'll miss another video. Now, Bob Arum obviously is out there in Vegas to support um, his white version of George Foreman, Tyson Fury. But also, he spoke on Errol Spence once again. Now, originally, he talked to Jay Calderon Boxing about uh, that, you know, they was trying to do Crawford and Errol Spence in October. I was the first one to talk about that, you know, um, along with Jay Calderon Boxing, okay? And um, basically, Bob Arum is saying now that pretty much the reason that, you know, it's being said that, you know, Earl Spencer, Sean Porter being held up. And now that, you know, they was originally wanting to do it on Fox uh, the last Sunday before, you know, uh, football came back. And they was going to use NFL Fox promotion like they used it last year to big up, you know, PBC uh, debuting on Fox. OK, they was going to use that again to hype up Sean Porter, Earl Spence. But he says they don't have enough money to accommodate Errol Spence's wishes. And that's why that fight ain't been uh that's why that fight ain't been done yet with Sean Porter and uh Errol Spence. He said if the fight was done, why they ain't announced it. Now Derek James came out on Instagram and said the fight had already been signed. That sound like a fucking lie. Kenny Porter saying exactly what he what he already knows. Errol Spence has committed to fighting because Errol Spence is not only pricing himself out Earl Spence want that pay-per-view money. And what the reporter said in the interview, which I linked the interview in the description on the source link, he said that, hey, man, when you go on pay-per-view, you ain't trying to uh, go back. And Bob Aram said precisely. He says the only way Earl Spence can see that type of money, or that real pay-per-view money or the money that he asking for is to fight Terrence Crawford on pay-per-view. Now, there's some, there got to be some truth here to this. He right. If they had to fight... If the fight was a done deal, you would hear it was a done deal. You would hear them they get the copper ringer or or anybody, you know, Fred from Barbershop Conversation, any of these dudes out here that talk that shit or the behind the scenes stuff. They will leak that shit to them. It's Earl Spence want real money. And I think and it really started when he seen a guy that ducked him and Danny Garcia and a guy that he just beat down, Mikey Garcia, allegedly uh slated for a pay-per-view fight. So he said, you know what? If I can't get a pay-per-view day, I want to run a checkup. He And Bob Arum didn't disrespect him. He said, you know what? Earl Spence, I think Earl Spence want the fight. But you know what the problem is, too, is, is that that fight going to have to get pushed back from October. Earl Spence look a little chubby. Okay? But Bob Arum insists if it don't happen, hey, Bob, Terrence Crawford is still going to fight in the fall. Versus the very best opponent out there. The best welterweight they can find. Excuse me. But pretty much it's Earl Spence holding the fight up with Sean Porter for more money. And that that's that's why Showtime got back in the picture. Okay. Earl Spence is playing for keeps. He paying for that bag. He knows. He's seen that Sean Porter fight versus you guys like we all did. Nobody come to see Sean Porter. He sees the fact that, you know what, I can go to Frisco Star or I can go, you know, in, in my hood, American Airlines Arena, and I can I can at least bring 10,000 people there. Sean Porter can't bring no people in his adopted home of Las Vegas or nobody in the Cleveland Akron area want to come see him. I'm the pool here. He don't deserve to get no money. And Kenny Porter, at the end of that, Kenny Porter, like, hey, look here, we got the WBC belt. You know what I'm saying? We've been pro longer than Sean Earl Spence. You know, Kenny Porter not going to let Sean Porter take no, uh, take no, 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 uh, no, no terrible split. They want to get paid too. So Earl Spence asking for a ton of money that the networks on regular TV can't accommodate. So Fox is already, already probably slated to do. They did Adrian Broner pay-per-view with Pacquiao. They did a Spence pay-per-view with Mikey. They did another pay-per-view. They doing another pay-per-view next month with Thurman and, and Pacquiao. They rumored to do another pay-per-view. Uh, uh, excuse me. They didn't do Pacquiao Broner. Sorry, that was Showtime. But they done three. They got three pay-per-views probably coming up already. Okay, 
Earl and, Earl and Adrian, I mean, see, Earl and, I'm sorry, Earl and Mikey, okay? Thurman and Pacquiao, and probably Mikey and Danny Garcia, that's three. Okay, Showtime's going to have two this year, at least. They're going to have Deontay Wilder and Luis Ortiz, okay? And then they're going to have, um, they had Adrian Broner and Pacquiao. So that's what they, at the end of the day, now Showtime was willing to open up the budget to get that fight. But where Earl Spence is not paying attention to it, that's going to hurt his stock. He's not willing to take a loss to get a game. And what I mean by that is, okay, I take less to go on Fox the last Sunday before football come back on, right? I take that L to get there, right? But more people going to watch that fight. That's going to be on a Sunday. They're going to build the fuck out of that fight. That fight going to be running with, with the promos, the preseason promos, and football fans got the biggest uh, fan population out, out the pie than any other sport. You know, but at the end of the day, he ain't going to fight a, a Terrence Crawford right now. He ain't in no type of shape. That fight going to have to go down November, December instead of October, more December. He not in shape to fight Terrence Crawford right now. And ESPN only did one pay-per-view. They don't have another pay-per-view coming up in them this year. So they got the pay-per-view date, and Walt Disney got deeper pockets. Don't forget Walt Disney on Fox. They don't own Fox Sports because that's a monopoly because they got ESPN, but they own Fox. They got the money, you know, but do Earl, do Earl Spence Handlers want him to fight Bud? And I say no. Bob Aaron want to get the fight to happen because right now it's a 50-50 fight. He understand that. The split is down the middle. One champion, one other champion. Earl Spence got one more title defense than Terrence Crawford. He understand right now financially it's easy to do. And he knows that Terrence Crawford gone. He believed Terrence Crawford and Lomachenko two of the baddest motherfuckers on the planet. He believed Terrence Craw Crawford is in shape. We talked about it earlier. Bud Crawford is in shape. Errol Spence is not. He heavy. You know? So he ain't going to piss on Errol Spence's name. He just been a fact. They don't have enough money to accommodate him. To fight Sean Porter. They don't have enough money. So, I mean, he, you know, if the fight was done, it'd be done. So, at the end of the day, somebody lying between Sean Porter, Daddy Kenny, and Derrick James. And I'm going to go ahead and on the limb and say it's Derrick James. Sean, Errol Spence ain't signed to take this fight. They didn't. This this nigga's pricing himself out. And it's not because he's scared of Sean. It's because, you know, he, I mean, if I'm going to go on regular TV and this, and this scrub, Mikey Garcia, basically quit first me, this scrub get to go on, 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 on national television, you tripping. You know, he get to go on pay-per-view and I don't. So I feel him on that, man. So Bob, you know, for the last couple of weeks since it was in Kissimmee, Kissimmee, uh, Florida, when Jamel Heron captured his first world title, beating uh, Ito, he been saying he's trying to get this fight done. But you know what? You know, people, Earl Spence apologists is gonna, are, are, are going to defend, you know, whatever move he make. Oh, Bob Beer made this and this and that and this and that. Hey, he trying to make the fight happen. He said, I believe Earl want the fight. But you know who don't want the fight? PBC. Al Heyman don't want that fight right now. And truth be told, you know, I think some of the other handlers with Earl Spence don't want it right now. It makes more sense to beat Sean Porter and get a better percentage split versus Bud. But the, how out of shape he looking, he best not fight Bud in no October. I mean, he can't get beat. He need to get into some shape and stop eating all these hot Cheetos and, 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 and water burgers and, 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 and whatever else he doing out there, you know, because... He, he better be in inverse Sean Porter, man. Sean Porter's already in camp. So we'll see what's going on. So uh, Bob Aaron was keeping us an update. I'll link that interview in the description of the source link. But, you know, he ain't hating no shit like that. He's just talking like, man, I'm trying to get it done. If not, we'll move on probably basically to Kell Brook or the next best available welterweight for Terrence Crawford this fall. You know, so it is what it is. It's Good Fellas Sports TV. Appreciate the love and support. Don't forget we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out to the email if you have a business question, inquiry, sponsorship, or video request. 
Continue to share the videos. Don't forget to check out our sponsor, The Help Blaze, at thehelpblaze.com. Promo code goodfellow one boxing gets you 18%, often 100% all natural products. Soaps, lotions, foot soaps, bad bonds, much, much more. Website, promo code, description. And uh, keep sharing the videos, man. Appreciate the love. Check out the Patreon, make a donation, check out our playlist, and much, much more. All those links in the description, intro, instrumental link, one time for the one time.